Yeah, I'll I see your GoPro. Yeah. yeah. I've got several of them. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Morning. Morning. How are you doing? Good. I'm going to buy this uh, printer here. Awesome. Um, $650 printer. Does it work as far as you know? Yes, sir. Okay, I'm going to leave it there and I'm going to keep shopping. Okay. But I will buy that one. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you. You guys be safe. Does this one work too? Uh, yeah, it's a little older. It, uh -huh. Actually, it's a lot older, but it definitely works. You just got to get the ink from yeah. like, staples or I'll something. I'll go ahead and take that one too. So I'm up to 18 bucks. I owe you. That was the hottest photographer printer. Was it really? Are Alex. you a photographer? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Awesome, yeah. man. Yeah. I'll That's see it. your GoPro. Yeah. yeah. I've got several of them. Yeah, cool. Yeah. I got a YouTube channel. I go around to garage sales and oh. find stuff. You yeah. Want that. Cool, man. Thank you. Uh -huh. Yeah, these scooters are killer. Oh, and they, they move too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I need 18 for the two printers. Okay. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Good luck with your sale. Thank you, sir. I gave her the money for the printers. Okay. What's your uh, YouTube channel? Cincinnati Picker. Cincinnati Picker? Yeah, kind of okay. like American Pickers, but Cincinnati. Okay. Yeah. I'll check it out, man. Cool, thanks. Good morning. How are you today? Doing well. You have any video games? I don't think I do. No. Any like um, vinyl records? No. No. I'm gonna buy this. That's pretty cool. All right. There you go. Thank you. Sure. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. How are you doing today? Morning, how are you? Right. Looking for something in particular? You have any vinyl records? Vinyl. I've got CDs. Do you? Vinyl. Okay. We got rid of those like 30 years ago. Yeah, I, I oh, yeah. never bet, it, bet on a comeback for those. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. You have the remote for this? Yes, I is that Sony? Samsung. Samsung. Oh yeah, here we go. There's more down here too. Let's see, here's a Sony, Toshiba, two Sonys. Might be down in here somewhere. No, I didn't see the Samsung. Good morning. Hi. 
buy the whole set for seven bucks. Um, the this for seven bucks? Yeah, I'll do that. Okay. I'll give you six for the Samsung. How much are you asking for this one? And that. Where did you put that dolly? Huh? I put it in the corner. Five. Okay, so uh, seven and six is thirteen, and five is eighteen. Eighteen, right? Yeah, and you weren't able to find the remote for it. Let me go downstairs. And yeah, check. sure. Yeah. And if I can't find it, I'll knock something off. Oh, it's not a big deal. I'm fine with giving you the. It's only six bucks. Three, four, six. There's eighteen. Right, thank you. Thank you, sir. Morning. Good morning. How are you today? Good. How are you? Good. How much is your stereo stuff here? Oh, that right there. The whole set and it works seventy five dollars. Seventy five dollars. Mm -hmm. Okay. And it uh, we it's got the cassette. Um, it, I forget what my husband called this. Okay. I mean, I could do sixty five. Sixty five. Yeah. Okay. Let me think about it. Okay. You selling your mannequins? Not my mannequins. Okay. Well, this one I will after my garage sale. What are you going to ask for it? Um, 30. 30 bucks. Yeah. And uh, I, I had three of them. Yeah. And I put them on um, a which side. Anyway, I had a bit in the Oh, did you really? Wow. Uh, yeah, two women, they were like, oh, yeah. But these, right more, and I think my son, I don't know if he maybe once. Okay. Did you ever use your cosmetics? The, uh, those are new. They're all new. Yes. Oh, well, now this is new. That's new. This one was open. This okay. is. Oops, this is new. The this one's new. This one may have been sprayed a little bit, but these are on the, and they have never been used. Okay. Um, fingernail polish, cake, they've never been used. Okay. Um, I could negotiate if you want to end the, the bow. Um, if you want. Just got to get rid of it all, huh? I'm getting rid of it. I'm downsizing in five years. All right, I got $7 worth. I'm sorry. I got $7 worth oh, here. Okay. I just got three pieces. Okay. There Thank you go. You. Thank you, ma'am. I'll keep poking around, see what yeah, else I might be able to find. Um, the others. Morning. How much is your bed? Uh, 30. 30? Is it like an air mattress? Yeah, it is. Okay. And it's self-inflating and self-deflating. Well, that's cool. That's a cool piece. How long have you had that? Forever. Yeah? Where'd you get it? You know, my dad was into uh, rendezvous, which is living history stuff. Oh, yeah? He used that as one of their kind of candle things. I don't know where he got it or how long he's got it. But I got like three more of them. So I like... Do you really? <laughs> yeah. Do you want to sell the other ones? No, I'm going to keep... I'm, I, I, I've got a bunch of lanterns. You, you interested in... Well, shit, I didn't bring lanterns with me. Um, I can give you my number. Got a bunch of like old style lanterns. Yeah, I'd love to um, take a look at them. Six or eight that look like this. Okay. They're cool old things. Yeah. Um, I just, I, I'd have to, I don't know what these, these are, these are certainly worth more than something like that, right? Okay. I don't know what I'd sell them for. Yeah, but I sure. Got, I got like six or eight of them. Sure. Here, let me they're, pay you for this one. They're cool little things, though. I give them a second for this guy. I get some CDs too, actually. Eight bucks. Oh, okay. There you go. Here, I'll give you a card if you want to text me about the other ones. Sure. Buy, sell, trade. Oh, that's cool. Water filter. Thanks, guys. You're welcome. Have a good day. You too.
I think they're all two dollars actually. They're all two? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna set this here. Sure. I'm gonna buy that and I'll look through your records. I got 15 of these, and I owe you five for that. $35. How about you get a helmet for free, CP? I appreciate that. Oh, thanks, man. You watch your videos? Yep, like your videos. Appreciate that. There you go. I thought, uh, so how much is that? 30, 30 bucks. All right, sounds good. I thought Lonnie might be here this weekend or something. Said uh, next, weekend. next weekend. Next weekend? Yeah. He's making the drive up. What are you guys gonna do? Anything, uh, hey, garage sales. I think we're gonna like? go up to Dayton too and show them the uh, Air Force Museum. Like that, I think. Yeah, yeah. He was in the Air Force and he's big into planes. And cool. I've been trying to explain it to him. It's like hard to fathom unless you see it in person. Like yeah. it's just so big. Was it open? You know. I'm pretty sure it is. I'll have to call him and make sure. Yeah. It seems like some of these government things are all shut down. So. Yeah, that's true. I mean, the place is so big. There's enough room to spread out. You know. Yeah, plenty of room up there. Yeah, for sure. You guys got a good day for this. You've been doing good. Yeah. Yeah. A little slow, or whatever. Yeah. Did you get rid of the off the sale off the Democrat? Democrat. No, which one's that? Oh, the whole neighborhood. Yeah. I haven't been over there yet. I was over in um, Liberty Township. I did uh, Cedar Brook. I'm pretty good over did there. Good? Yeah, I did awesome in there. That's good. For sure. Yeah, there's a lot this weekend. Yeah, I know. Surprising this time of year. Surprising. Yeah. Oh, so. Out there yeah, today, for sure, man. Well, hey, good meeting right. you. Good, good luck with the sale. I get your helmet for a buck. Okay. Would you do uh, 15 on your racket? Yes. Okay, so you're 16 bucks. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day, guys. All right, guys, I am back at the warehouse, and today was fantastic. I found so much good stuff. It was probably my best day garage shelling in the last few weeks. I'm excited to show you guys everything I found. All right, I got this helmet right here. This is a ski helmet, I'm pretty sure. It looks like they attached some kind of GoPro attachment to it. It might have already had that installed, actually. That was only a dollar. It's a little bit rough, but it should clean up. I've done okay selling those in the past. Got a big stack of records. There are 15 of them. I paid $30 total. They're not 
like amazing titles. We get like Cool on the Gang, Temptations, Mums and the Papas. I'm thinking I should average six or seven dollars a piece selling those out of my antique booth. I got this Samsung um, DVD VCR combo unit. I paid six dollars for it. It didn't have the remote. The guy was looking everywhere for the remote and then he ended up giving me a couple dollars back, which was super nice of him. This box here, there is a Magnavox DVD player in there that I paid five for. It's still new and everything. I think I could maybe get 20 bucks for it. A couple of pipe glasses I got for a quarter each. Let's see, I think that's Magic Hat number nine, maybe? My dad collects pipe glasses, so that's going to him. And this one is actually going to my brother-in-law, Brennan, Los Poyos Hermanos. He's a big Breaking Bad fan, so I'll have to get that to him. I got some makeup at one sale. At least I think it's makeup. What is this? It's like an acne treatment. Kate Somerville. Um, these were $2 each. Looks like they're selling for about $15 on eBay. And this was $3. Martian Melting Gel Toner. Uh, that seems to be going for about $20. And then one other mug I got for a quarter, along with those pints. Uh, this is Starbucks Fox Mug. Not sure if it's worth anything, but sometimes Starbucks mugs can be worth some money, so I just took a chance. I got this Babolat Racket for $15. Needs a new grip, but that's not a big deal. Anytime I find Babolat Rackets, if they're a decent enough price, I pick them up because they sell really well. This is the Pure Drive Team Racket. I should get 50 or 60 bucks for that. I bought this You Don't Know Jack game for $2. I've never seen this before. It's brand new in the box. I saw one sold comp of $40 free shipping, so I'm thinking it should be worth $20, $25, something like that. Got these elephant bookends for $2. These will be good for the antique booth. Um, they're not vintage or anything, but they just have a cool look to them. This is one of my favorite finds of the day. This is an old lantern, and there's, a, there's some kind of like stamp on the bottom. I don't know if you guys can see that right there. It was hard to read, but I think it said marine lamp. And it does have oil in it, so I'm going to have to drain the oil before I sell this thing. But I saw sold comps around 50 60 bucks. Picked up an Xbox 360 wireless controller for $3. Those tend to bring about 15 or 20 Got all these Harry Potter audiobooks. I think it's mostly CDs, but maybe a couple cassettes. Let's see here. Well, these are definitely cassettes. That's cassettes. Oh, racket's falling on me. Um, but we've got... These are CDs right here. These are CDs. All right, so I think two of the seven are CDs and the rest are cassettes. The cassettes will sell. It'll just take them longer. Um, total, the guy was asking, let's see, nine, 10, 11, 12. He was asking 13 and he just threw out a number of $7 for all of them. And I was like, yep, I'm happy to pay that because they should each bring, I think about 15 to 20 bucks. I got this football helmet at the same sale as the Wreckers, and it turned out it was actually a viewer of the channel that was running that garage sale, and he just threw in this helmet for me for free, so that was really nice of you. Thank you so much, man. I got this plant stand for $3. It needs a screw right here, so I'm sure I've got one laying around the house that'll fit it. This should do pretty well in the antique booth, probably $20, $25, something like that. But by far the best find of the day is right here. This is an Epson. Stylus Photo R1900 uh, photo printer. Anytime you see these wide printers like this, if they're a good price, go ahead and pick them up. I did go ahead and look it up when I was at the sale, and this thing's selling used for around $300, $350, which is just amazing. It's not going to be fun to ship, and I'm going to have to do some testing with this thing. I talked to a buddy who has dealt with these before, and he kind of gave me an idea of what to look out for, you know, how to do a, a good test with them. So I'm going to have to see if it still works. Hopefully it does. It looks really clean inside, but, you know, for $15, which is what I paid for it, it's pretty hard to go wrong because I think I could probably sell it as is for parts for at least $75 or $100. Bucks. They had another printer there. Uh, it's an HP. It's also a wide one, so I think it's a photo printer. didn't have a power cord, but it's kind of a universal plug back there, and I think I got some extras that will fit it. I did not look this one up since it was so cheap. It was only $3. It's the HP DeskJet 9650. I just looked it up and I cannot find Soul Comp. So I'll have to maybe look on Worth Point C, but I'm thinking maybe $50, $75, something like that. That's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. <laughs>